Who did what, when, why, and where? What's their name? It's time to share. Who are we about to meet? It's the Patriot of the Week. Hercules Mulligan was an early American tailor and a spy for the Continental Army during the Revolutionary War. In 1746, at six years old, he moved with his family from Northern Ireland to New York, where he attended college, worked for his father, and then opened a tailoring shop. He was an early member of the Sons of Liberty and the New York Committee of Correspondence. He also let a young student named Alexander Hamilton lodge with him while attending college. Mulligan was influential in convincing Hamilton to support independence. After the Revolutionary War broke out in 1775, Mulligan was forced to stay in British-controlled New York after Washington's retreat at Long Island. Washington needed someone to send him intelligence from inside New York, and Alexander Hamilton, now serving as Washington's aide-de-camp, recommended Mulligan. Mulligan worked together with his slave, Cato, to send Washington the information they learned from the British, who came to have their uniforms repaired. Twice, their information saved Washington's life. At the war's end, Mulligan was in danger of being persecuted as a British sympathizer. But Washington cleared his name when he visited Mulligan, had breakfast with him, and purchased new clothes from his store. Mulligan put up a sign outside his store that read, Clothier to General Washington. Mulligan went on to have a long and successful career as a tailor. He co-founded the abolitionist New York Manumission Society with Alexander Hamilton and several others, and he was buried beside Alexander Hamilton at Trinity Church.